Now to sport with Meredith Sheehan. You think I deserve your full attention? You have part of my attention. You have the minimum amount. The next time you wish you didn't have to go into the job that pays your bills, be careful for what you wish for. And for the love of God, don't post it on social media. Officer James Anthony has been fired for this post, wondering why no one has, quote, offed Nation of Islam leader Louis Farrakhan. Are you crazy? Or just plain stupid? See if you can guess what I am now. Whether seasoned veteran that's become more than a little bored with the usual hustle and crush of daily broadcast news, or the everyday worker that fails to see the damage that can be wrought by the overuse and misuse of social media, one thing is now certain in every corner of our personal and professional lives. The media is pervasive and affects us all. It changes our thinking process, the way we conduct ourselves with family and friends, how we move about the professional world seeking new ways to carve out our niche and success and most important, how we choose to use the media in every single form to our advantage, which is where mastering the media comes into play, whether for an individual lesson, a group of 20 new employees, the three individuals atop the sea level of an emerging business, the company with tens of thousands of employees, or you, wrapped up in the daily machine that is broadcast, internet, and social media. Simply stated, this is media intelligence and media strategy for this generation and well beyond. Hi, I'm Ed Berliner, and I've been a part of the media my entire adult life, which of course means I've been in the trenches since well before Marconi was born, and right around the time cave dwellers suddenly realized they had to trademark those drawings because they were being stolen by those cavers down at the tar pits. Mastering the media is not simply media training. I've never been comfortable with that title. Anybody can be taught how to talk into a microphone. Anybody can be taught how not to dress properly for a media interview. Mastering the media is the deep dive into every facet of the media and provides background intelligence, knowledge, and strategy of how the various forms of media work, what they want from you, how to avoid being used, and then how to use every form of media to your advantage every single time. From the broadcast side, learn what drives every network and station to an editorial conclusion, who the reporters are, what their history tells you about the interview and the story, how the ownership of the outlet changes their stance, what they want from you in the interview, and how being armed with as much information as possible about the interviewer, you're prepared to ensure your story gets told every time. Your facts are presented in a manner that will make you look good every time. And if you'll never be on camera, no worries. Mastering the media will make you a better prepared news consumer. An employee at Taco Bell in Ridgecrest got into trouble when his co-worker posted pictures of him licking the taco shells on Facebook. The post appeared on Taco Bell's Facebook page and created serious controversy. The shell-licking employee and his co-worker were both fired from the joint as the company's management tried to calm down the hype and ensure its loyal customers that all the steps were taken to resolve the issue and keep the people's trust. The company condemned the act and said such behavior cannot be tolerated. Then there's social media. How to avoid texting, writing, printing, saying anything that will derail your personal and professional life. What the keywords are that will get you in trouble and those that will rise your content above the noise. Understand the various platforms, what they're looking for, and how if it's cost-effective public relations and marketing you seek, ensures it reaches the right people, the decision makers, and will avoid a waste of time and money from firms and individuals that claim they know all about how the media works, but have never spent a single day in a news setting, a production office, a social media creativity and development session. In other words, they've never been in those media trenches and never learned from first-hand experience. Hey look, if you want the best doctor to do the work, don't hire one that's only learned how to handle a scalpel by reading about it. Get someone in there who has used the tool and saved lives. Are you ready to be thrown off your game at every single step? Because this is a full contact sport. <laughs> Being on television these days is not just sitting there giving an interview. It is a full contact. Put the helmet on and be ready to do battle. Remember that video we saw at the top with people banging heads with each other? Everybody's got to get their message in. That's full contact. Of course, there's an element of old-style media training in what I do. I've worked with C-level executives, getting them ready to become network analysts, 
Doctors and attorneys who also seek to promote their business and then become the go-to interview for medical and legal questions by local, national, and global media. And I, for years, worked with athletic departments, athletic directors, coaches, and players to face a dogged press. But as part of the training they get nowhere else is, again, that deeper understanding to who and what the media is. They put it this way, great athletes know their plays, but they also school themselves in what the opposition will do, every facet of what the other side may throw at them. Mastering the media fills in those gaps and delivers what, in essence, is a complete playbook. Finally, back to that news consumer idea. Not everybody will be an interview subject, but with the vast proliferation of media around the world, there's a critical need to know and understand the honest difference between real and fake news, the telltale signs of those who shape the news for their advantage at your expense, the outlets that truly stick with the facts compared with those who hide their true meaning. Television, radio, newspaper, newspaper websites, magazine websites, internet platforms dedicated to the web only, social media disguising itself as news. Now more than ever, everyone needs to be an educated news consumer. Learn the difference between what's being pushed to make you little more than informational sheep and how just a few minutes every day, a few simple keystrokes and a simple desire to be informed and educated makes all the difference in breaking from the mold of being led by the noise. Mastering the Media is presented in a keynote and guest speaker setting with yours truly, backed by decades of broadcast news, production, management, and leadership experience. Hey, don't be taken in by media trainers giving you a mere taste of what you need to know. Master the media, every form of media, every single time. Never let them see you sweat. Oh, and be prepared to deliver a few blows of your own at precisely the right place and the right time. Mr. McLean, M Mr. McLean, now that it's all over after this incredible ordeal, what are your feelings? Did you get that? 